So what does it could do this time? Today we're here with a video where we block a salary cap and then you trade override. So this video is can trade override make me a team that goes 82 and 0? So yeah, let's get right into the video uh, trades. So we got all the settings correct. If I just mess the settings up, I'm pretty sure. Nope. Okay, that seems like that's good. Yeah, trade override is off. We can fix that once we get into the season. So what team will we be to start off this rebuilding challenge? It looks like we will be the Golden State Warriors. That is perfect because they already have a point guard that I love and a shooting guard that I love. So that is a great way. And I'll see you guys when we can make our first trade. So guys, as you know, salary cap is not a problem. So we're just going to basically go try and give them trash. There we go. Trade over on boom. Now we have Giannis and Curry. Now I would like a different starting shooting guard. That is for sure. Let's trade. Why don't we take Luca so that we have some sort of defense? All right. Uh, so who do we give them? We'll give the Mavericks. Bogdan Bender. We'll give the Mavericks. Mavericks take Luca. There we go. So now we have a point guard, shooting guard, and power forward to start. Um, proposed trade. Basically, this whole video is me trying to make the best team possible because I can make teams give me players for free, basically. Who do we want small forward? Why don't we put Coffee Leona Rad at small forward? Let's go! Uh, next. So now we just need a center, it looks like. So, who's a good center? We take Jokic. Like, he seems like a pretty good option. LeBron doesn't play center, obviously. Uh, we could take KP, but it looks like Jokic is probably our best option. It's either that or Joel Embiid. We'll have both on the team because we can take whatever players we want. So I guess, uh, oh shoot, on, I'm totally wrong tag. So yeah, next up, player, yeah, why don't we take Joel Embiid next. There we go. So now that we're working on our reserves, um, so now we have a backup center, and we need a backup. Now why don't we go for a backup point guard? Who is a good point guard? Uh, we can take LeBron. He's a small. Yeah, why don't we just take LeBron for now? Because we just saw him. Shoot, I hit the wrong button. Here we go. Now LeBron's on the team. Who else can we put on this team? Backup shooting guard. We'll probably just take Harden, obviously. Jordan Poole, sorry to take you off the team, but we're going to trade you for... Anthony Davis? Yeah, we don't have backup power forward yet. So now, guys, we just need two more backup players. And those two backup players will be Harden and a point guard. Damian Lee for... Hey, Lillard will be our backup point guard. There we go. And now, last trade of the day, uh, right, Kevon Looney for James Harden. Straight up, and I hit the wrong offer again. There we go. So now we have our uh, all 10 of our players that we need. So let's do a coaching game plan, see what they want for the rotation. Why are we still, oh my god. No, we do not want to do this. Take away all of Clay's minutes. Clay won't even be playing. This is how good this team is. Clay will not be playing on a team this good. So I'll see you guys once I've adjusted the rotation. So guys, I've set up the rotation. We're just going with everyone plays 24 minutes or all 10 of our players. I only I only went for 10 players because I felt like players would get tired. So yeah. So since we could not do or so yeah i just don't want players getting tired or injured so yeah that would be a problem though if someone gets an injury so there you go there's our lineup and i'll see you guys if we either lose a game or if we make it all the way to the end of the season so yeah so guys um i just kind of stopped here to see what the all-star games would be like uh so how many all-stars do we have we have one two Three, four, five, six, seven, 
Looks like seven of our players are all stars. Probably missing a few. But I think the main reason that not everyone's an all star is just because obviously everyone's sharing the ball. So that's probably why. Also, they're all only playing 24 minutes a game, which is a lot less than they normally do. So, yeah, see you guys if we lose or if we dominate the rest of the season. I'll see you guys at the end of the season. Oh my god, we lost! How? Okay. So, guys, we ended up losing this game somehow to the wizards what happened bro so it seemed like well obviously it seems like other players uh, wait are other players getting play time no no one else got play time in this game we lost by five what happened so everyone seemed to have a pretty decent game like for everyone having to share the rock what happened with the wizards bradley beal and okay so the wizards just played a really good game Jeez. okay so we lost one game so now i guess it's an 81 and one challenge and we're, we're almost done the season as well we have 21 games left. So I guess I'll see you guys at the end of the season, probably. Oh my god, we lost another game. So guys, we just lost another game by one point to the Philadelphia 76ers. Everyone seemed to play okay again. What happened, though, with these Sixers? Tobias Harris went off. They don't even have... <laughs> oh my god, they don't even have Joel Embiid. Uh, was it like... Okay, was it like a game winner? We only lost by one point. See you guys at the end of the season now, probably, hopefully. I don't want to lose any more games. So, guys, Russell Westbrook wins MVP. Zion wins Rookie of the Year. <laughs> Luka Doncic wins Sixth Man of the Year. Uh, because, basically, he's just too overpowered. Uh, he almost had 49 feet. Rudy Gobert, defensive player, most improved band. Coach of the Year, obviously, Steve Kerr. 80 and 2. I can't believe we lost two games, though, seriously. Uh, how many all NBA teams? We have one with Giannis Mann, all NBA team. No one else. Yeah, uh, we had two all defensive players, three all defensive players, no rookies, obviously. So we're uh, we better be the first seed. We are okay. Um, why don't we look at some stats? League leaders. I don't think we have any league leaders. What about player stats? What were people putting up on the team with the? So it looks like Luca was our leading scorer. Luca and James Harden. No one averaged over twenty, but everyone averaged more than ten. Who is pulling the boards for us? Yeah, see, again, no one averaged a crazy amount of rebounds. No one got that many ass assists, steals. God. I think the real thing I'm interested in, though, are team stats. So, obviously, we won the most games. What was our points per game? Oh, well, we averaged 140 points per game, almost. 139.9, if you want to be exact. But, yeah, so we were the best team in the league in that category. What about we all, our points allowed is also bottom. 103, really not that good. Then again, I guess our defense is like the point differential. 36 points per game, that's crazy. Uh, most field goal on the field goal percentage, we were also at the top. Uh, what about three-pointers? We were not first in three-pointers, but we were first in three-point percentage. The only team to shoot over 40%, free throw percentage, 81%, that's crazy. Only by 0.1% to be lead the league, though. Uh, about rebounds. Yeah, we were grabbing rebounds like crazy. Oh, no, that was just offensive rebounds. We were, okay, so we were grabbing all rebounds like crazy. We were passing the ball like, oh, my God. The next best team was almost 20 full assists per game behind us. Steals per game. We were second in the league. Wow. Magic leading the league. Uh, blocks, we led the league. Turnovers. How are we in the turnovers? We were last in turnovers, which is good. So I think that's all we need to know for now. Uh, we better win the championship. Probably gonna go 16 and 0 in the playoffs. Uh, let's see. Clippers, they don't have Kawhi Leonard anymore. They stand no chance. Boro. Uh, the Nuggets don't have Jokic, so they also have no chance of beating us. And then the Pelicans just aren't good. Screw them. The Celtics. We didn't take anyone from the Celtics, surprisingly. Luka Doncic finals MVP. So, yeah. That is a pretty crazy video. If you guys enjoyed, like and subscribe. We were not able to complete the challenge. This video gets to 5 likes. I will be making a re-attempt where I try to get 82-0 and 0 again. And hopefully succeed next time. So, yeah. If you guys enjoyed, like and subscribe for more. Peace out.